What's up guys, Charles from Two Thanks Dev and right now I'm going to show you a quick video on how to actually update from Windows 7 Ultimate that was uh, the OS which I was using previously before I installed Windows 10 Pro professional version uh, for my Alienware laptop so I actually tried to install 5 to 6 times unsuccessfully uh, because I was getting the issue stated in the title uh, it was preventing me at 40%. It was preventing me to actually install Windows 10. So I did some online research and uh, did some stuff. And I'm going to show you a real quick video on how to update your uh, or upgrade your OS to Windows 10 Professional. So here we go. I had actually installed my Windows 10 Professional from an ISO. I actually downloaded it from a torrent, uh, uTorrent. It's not a cracked version or anything like that. You still require a key to do it, which works. So you can actually check for the key on Google. The link in the description to get the key. Yep, so first of all, basically some background on my Windows 7 Ultimate before I upgraded it. Uh, just to let you know, I was using a fresh copy of um, Windows 7 Ultimate with basically no files you know, installed and stuff. Uh, it was a fresh copy, uh, there was nothing there, no, no antivirus, even an unactivated copy of the Windows 7 Ultimate. I didn't even activate it and I managed to do the upgrade. Just to show you the steps that I did. So if your copy is activated, it should work no problems because mine actually worked on an unactivated Windows 7 Ultimate. So this is the Windows 10. I'm gonna show you uh, the next step. Firstly, go to search and uh, search for Reg Edit which is short for register editor okay this should open up go to the string local machine local machine software microsoft windows current version scroll down to windows update and then and then on your windows 7 you will see os upgrade this is not in windows 10 but uh, this is where you navigate to and you will see an option called os update what you gotta do is Click right click anywhere under the OS update name then go to either if you're using 32-bit or 64-bit Windows 7 Ultimate so if you're using Windows 32-bit click that and name it allow OS upgrade it is case sensitive all right, so hit enter. Double click that and change the value to one. And then click OK. So that's first step done. So next step, go to MS config under search. As you can see at the bottom. Go under services, hide all Microsoft devices, basically check that box and whatever that is here, even if you got a few hundred stuff running, doesn't matter, click disable all, click on that, press apply, press ok and that should prompt the computer to uh, get you to reboot or restart your computer. So once you've rebooted or restarted your Windows 7, once you're back in, next step is to disable your antivirus um, or any software that prevents you know, attacks or malware 
uh, application so disable all of that then next step disable your internet Wi-Fi adapter so in order to do that you need to go to networks and settings on your uh, Windows 7 it's slightly different on the Windows 10 go to change adapter options and for your if you're using Wi-Fi then right click and disable your Wi-Fi connection okay if you turn it off it might come back on so it's safer to disable it if you're using an Ethernet cable just unplug that as well as well so got it and then last step of course is to run your Windows 10 professional um, installation or upgrade um, you can either use the ISO which I did by downloading it into my computer or if you're using Windows update then um, I guess you would require internet connection so leave this Wi-Fi on uh, once it's finished downloading the full Windows uh, 10 from the Windows update then you can uh, when once it reaches 100% then you disable your Wi-Fi so things should work um, if it doesn't I'm sorry this is the way I did it after trying many many times so I hope this works for you thanks for watching see you in the next video